Oh, hey guys, Shea Ali here with your weekly entertainment news. Garina Kapoor Khan is currently preparing for her big role in Karan Johar's Takht. But in the meantime, the actress has been approached by Vanessa Body Deodorant, the premium fragrance brand, to be the face of their perfume. The brand recently launched its new ad which released around the world on Women's Day and celebrates womanhood, self-love and confidence. Going back to Karina's work, her film Takht is set for a 2020 release and also stars Ranveer Singh, Vicky Kaushal, Alia Bhatt, Anil Kapoor, John V. Kapoor and Bhumi Pednikar. Varun Dhawan and Sara Ali Khan have been confirmed for the remake of the 90s film Kuli No. 1 produced by Rohit Dhawan and directed by David Dhawan. The original film starring Govinda and Karishma Kapoor was a blockbuster for its songs, dialogues and complete masala package. While Varun has already proven his comedic timing with movies like Me Tera Hero and Jurva 2, Sara with Simba has proved that she is also a total commercial Bollywood film heroine. This will be the first time we'll see the two come together. Varun is currently promoting his multi star Kalank and is also busy shooting Street Dancer with Shraddha Kapoor in London. When Kangana Ranaut announced that she would be starring in her epic, she rose a lot of questions about the possibility of the film. However, putting an end to all speculations, Telugu Hindi writer Vijayendra Prasad, who scripted Kangana Ranaut's Mani Karnika, The Queen of Jhasi, revealed that he is in fact currently writing Kangana's biopic while the actress will direct the project herself. Other details of the biopic are yet to be finalized, but it's safe to say that the movie will include all aspects of her life, from publicly known stories to the controversial ones. Shah Rukh Khan is all set to turn his attention full-fledgedly to the online streaming platform Netflix. His production house, Red Chili's Entertainment, was already in an advanced stage to produce a web series for Netflix based on Atul Sabharwal's project on the Mumbai Police Initiative to train special team of encounter specialists and shooters at the time when the underworld was at its peak in the city. Shah Rukh also helmed Bard of Blood, an adaptation of Bilal Siddiqui's espionage thriller for Netflix. Now a source close to the production house revealed that he has in fact signed three more projects with the online streaming platform and details about those projects will be out soon. It's reported that Shah Rukh currently wants to do more commercial projects and play it safe at the box office.